welcome to our playthrough of Star Ocean The End of Time. So, this is a game that I really enjoy. I'm gonna enable that real quick. Um, the opening, not so much. I get a little bored with the opening, but once it, the story gets going, I, I really enjoy it here. Uh, oh, just once. There we go. So the reason I enabled the event, event skip is because I know there's going to be a point where I'm going to get stuck. Excuse me, let me finish talking before you get upset with me. And anyways, we'll have to watch like a great big long cutscene all the time. So at least with the event skip, we won't have to. How did he not see her coming up? Oh, hi, Sophia. You startled me. I thought you were swimming down at the beach. Or even hear her coming up, for that matter. I was waiting for you, but you never came. You said you'd play uh -oh. a few games and then head right She's over. Mad. Sorry, I didn't plan on staying so long, but I got kind of sucked in. Yeah, I think all gamers have done that at least once. All right. Well, that's what I thought happened. Didn't you say you had tons of homework to do before we came to Haida anyway? Uh... But I was fighting so well today, and I leveled up a lot too, you know? That's not a good reason. Nice for you. Hmm. Someone's in a bad mood today. Uh, you stood her up. Yeah, she's gonna be a bad mood. What do you expect? You'd rather play games than hang out at the beach with me. Like... Sophia? Hmm. You aren't she... mad, are you? Blinks I'm not mad. Do you want to go to the beach? I swam enough, while somebody I know was having the time of his life playing games all by himself. Yeah. So, do you want to take a walk through the hotel? I bet it'll be fun. What do you say? Come on. Please. Pretty please. I'm not sure well, how that works. If you want to hang out with me that badly, I guess it's all right. Great. Let's go. Time's a wasted. Okay. Boy, she sure is taking forever. I bet she's making me wait on purpose. And of course, they fall into the whole cliche of women take forever to get dressed. Or get ready, whatever. Hi, babe. Took you long enough. What were you doing all that time? How are her pants staying up? Just changing. I didn't take that long, did I? Like, there's Besides, nothing actually. You kept me waiting. There. How long was it? Serves you right. Unless you know some sort of future technology. Right, right. <laughs> Shall we? Okay. Just don't yank my arm off. Alright. So, we can kind of walk into some of these rooms. We'll go into this one. It does cut the song off though, so it's kind of sad. This planet is really so peaceful. When I'm here, it's hard to believe the Federation forces are battling the Eldian Empire near Lambda, Lambda Sector at this very moment. Okay, so it's all in there. Oh, shoot. I actually didn't mean to run into this room, but. Look, pretty room. Oh. An empty room. 
empty box of cookies, candy wrappers, a biscuit? I don't think I've ever seen this. Talk about your overeating. You're gonna get pudgy. Oh, fate. Oh, oh, no. You do not say those words. Fate? Mind your own business. <laughs> Ouch. I tried to warn you. <laughs> okay, so 105 is Sophia's room. Where we started, I need to turn the camera again. I can't see where I'm going. <laughs> I kind of want to run around the room keep me messing with buttons. Alright, nothing here. Yep, let's leave. Alright, so this must be the room. Yes, this is the room I was thinking of. Oh, hello there. You're those youngsters next door, aren't you? Can I do something for you? Hey, talk to me. What are you doing barking in like that? There's something wrong, young man. Oh, sorry, I was just... Oh, don't worry. I wasn't chastising you. Yes, you were. Enthusiasm. I was not reading enthusiasm for a second there. <laughs> and curiosity are essential for young people. No doubt you sometimes feel that you just can't sit still. Uh, um, you don't say. I do? Why, well, that's how I was when I was young. By the way, this is a bit off the subject. But are you busy tomorrow? Come on, I'm sure you have some free time. After all, this is a resort. Right? 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 Why did you say right four times in a row? Well, I don't have anything planned in particular. Of course you don't. I knew it. In that case, you gotta go see the show. It's tomorrow, right here in the hotel. And of course, don't forget to tell your family about it. It'll be a once in a lifetime experience. No doubt. Alright. So remember these two, because they kind of become a bit important here and later. Uh, I think there's someone in that room, but I really don't care right now. So this hotel or staff member, yeah, sorry about four, just tells us that all these transporters are keyed onto the main floor. I also could have gone into the other end of the hall. Okay. This character is another interesting one. I'm gonna wait for Sophia to catch up with us. Okay. So. Hey, <laughs> hey, Fate. No matter what you may say, you really are having fun, aren't you? Uh, I wasn't trying to talk to you. There we go. Well, well. Greetings, fair princess and blue haired knight who attends her. The door that lies beyond is a gateway to evil that has been sealed by a holy man. Beyond the sealed door lurks an evil beast of chaos that would seek to infect her, inflict her, whoops, upon the princess. Infect her, okay. Though it may be my end, my appointed task is to protect these lands against the forces of chaos that would disturb the order of this world. Since the door shall remain sealed until the glass fills with water, and all the moons have waned. A princess of pure heart who shimmers like sunlight on water. O knight of valor who conceals the flames of rage within. You must hear and understand what I say. So, long story short. Door is locked. Nobody can get in. I heard the rumors, but I really didn't think there'd be this many earthlings here. Huh? Me? Up from Expel. Now I'm starting to feel like I'm in the soul system. Okay, so. Yeah, I was like, there's one more guy here. On top of the Albion Empire's forces, now we have to worry about the forces from Vendine, too. Both seem to be hurriedly on the move these days. Those Vendini seem to be on to something. I bet they're trying to counter the moves being made by the Aldean Empire. So that's all there is here. The 
these are all these are chat rooms. I think one or two of them have somebody in them, but I'm not gonna. I'm gonna go with the one. Alright. So go oh, geez. That character's too strong. This has gotta be a bug, right? What do you think? I mean Michael is way too strong. They gotta get rid of him already. Uh, talk to me. Honestly, that's a son of mine. I just wish he'd study a little more instead of playing games all the time. Except for P.E. His grades are terrible because of it. Uh, hey, talk to me. There we go. The games at our hotel are real are all realistic full-body simulations. I myself prefer the old type of game where you use a joystick or a controller. I think I'll have to have a word with the supplier. One more scene out here. In this room. This is one of my favorite events this early in the game. Because what? we get to meet this lovely little Who girl. Who are you? This is the Rossetti's dressing room. Hmm. Oh, I know. You want my autograph, don't you? She's so oh, well, wonderfully naive. Somebody walks into the room. Oh, do you want my autograph? Usually I'd be pretty mad if someone just came barging in like that. But you're so cute, I'll make an exception this time. Okay. Uh, um, you said the Rossettis? Yeah. What? You didn't know our troop's name? Don't go forgetting it now. Say, what's your name? I like how she just makes the same gesture over and over again. Fate, but... I'm Sophia. Okay. Right. That was a completely uninterested right. To my darling Fate. From the Fairy of Illusions, Pepito Rossetti. All done. Okay. What the? My favorite part about this is actually her signature. Hey. Her autograph. You can't just draw on somebody's shirt. It stays there for the rest of the game. Huh? What? I thought you wanted my autograph. Her necklace is floating. I just noticed that. Nobody said anything about wanting an autograph. Huh? But... I mean... What? But I thought... Now she's all confused. Then... You want my mama's autograph? Or... My papa's? Okay. You can't want Ganella the Clown's autograph. Or... Ursus the Strongman. Right? Uh, well, we don't actually want autographs. No. We're not really looking for anyone's autograph. Huh? Well, what then? Are you a salesman? Nah. Come to think of it, you look like the kind of guy who's never done an honest day's Ouch. work in his life. I know. You're here to collect on a loan. So you're too early. That loan's good until next month, they promised. Long sharks have been known to not exactly be the most trusted people. No, no. Or honest, trustworthy. I'm not sure. Whatever word actually gets the last sentence. Who are the Rossettis anyway? And what's with this fairy of illusion stuff? My question is, what's with those uh, cat creatures right above Sophia's head? Mm. It looks weird. Okay, so we've gone from being fans to being loan sharks. Now we're lost. Well, we're not really lost. Oh no! And now You're we're robbers. robbers. Wow. No, not that either. That's quite the progression. 
Then what are you? You're not one of my fans. You're not here to collect on our loan. You're not lost. So what do you think you're doing barging into our room like this? Um, I'm sorry for barging into your room. We were just taking a little walk, checking out the place. Uh... Isn't that right, Sophia? Mm -hmm. You know, you, you should actually, like, talk. A walk? Yeah, it's a thing where you, you, you delay. Yeah, a walk. Barging into people's rooms isn't called taking a walk. You've got a good point. That's for burglars or lost kids or stalkers or groupies. Where did stalkers come from? Burglars, lost kids, groupies, okay, those three she all mentioned before. Where'd stalkers come from? Uh, okay then, <laughs> we're lost. Let's get out of here, baby. Good idea. Well, uh, she's right so in front of the door, lost. so... You're a performer? Yeah... Did, did you really not pick that That's up? That's right! We're the Rossetti Troupe, and we bring you a fleeting vision of the future. I'm your fairy guide, Papina Rossetti! Okay. Well, if you want to hear it in plain Terrence, we're a circus troupe, and I am sort of the host. You mean that wasn't played, Karen? Because I understood that. Oh, so this shirt with your signature is going to be worth something. We'll see. Of course! It's the first autograph I ever signed. The first? Uh, yeah, she kind of mentioned that a few Tomorrow's times. Tomorrow's my debut. In six months, why, you could buy a whole planet with that shirt. have earrings on, right? What looks like she does. Uh, it's connected to her necklace. Oh yeah? Amazing. An entire planet. I guess I'll have to take good care of it. Say so. Hey! There, oh, she does have an earring on. Me. So I'm gonna go along with her and be like, nope, I believe you. No, I believe you. I'm sure you'll be dynamite on the stage. about that. Gee, thanks. I'm looking forward to the show. Great. See you later, Fate. Yay, we got our first ride on. I kind of like the music for this. Alright, I'm done. Alright. We can talk to them, but I'm actually just going to kind of push this for free forward. If I get in the door. I just remembered this hotel has one of those new combat simulator games. We have some free time, so maybe I should try to get Sophia to play a game or two with me. Alright. There we go. Games again? But you were just playing. Keep playing games all the time like that, and you'll turn into a brainless muscle man. I don't know if that should be an ouch or not. Hmm. What to do? Alright, we're gonna go try to persuade. Why don't you give it a try, Sophia? It's really fun. Kind of need to do this to move the story but forward. Isn't this one of those combat simulators? Don't you have to fight? No, 
smell can do. I don't like these kind of things. That's fair. Alright, so this one just sees very manipulative. I'm gonna do this one. Don't worry. I'll protect not you. Not that it's not manipulative, but it feels a little bit less slimy, I guess. I'd never let you do anything dangerous. I promise. Come on, try it. Settle. Let's start at an easy level since you're a beginner. Well, yeah, that's only fair. You'd prefer a character that uses symbology from a distance rather than one that fights up front, right? Yeah, well, it won't hurt, will it? Don't worry. Beginner's level doesn't hurt at all, really. Okay. We'll see about that. Okay, I'll give it a try. <laughs> I love how it's like close up on the signature. Or, sorry, the autograph. All right then, we're about ready. All right. Welcome to the battle simulator. Please set battle system parameters. What do you want to do, Sophia? Let's start from the beginning. You want to take a look at the instructions? Probably should. I don't know. Should I? I don't think I'm going to, but... You probably should. Otherwise, it won't be much fun. Okay. I will. Alright. Uh, you can use the battle simulator here. The battle simulator allows you to play the battle tutorial, initialize your battle trophies, and view descriptions, among other things. Battle trophies. A battle trophy is something that proves you have satisfied certain conditions in a battle. There might even be special rewards for those who collect enough battle trophies. Gathering battle trophies requires a memory card with at least 1,200 kilobytes available. Make sure to initialize your battle trophies. Gathering battle trophies requires a memory card to be always inserted in one of the memory card slots. Precautions. Battle trophy data for each game is unique. And if there are multiple sets of battle trophy data, only the data for the battle trophies that were created or loaded in the session may be saved. You cannot create new battle trophy data during the game once you have loaded battle trophy data. After this event, you cannot initialize your battle trophies during the game. You cannot use the battle trophies feature when playing on Earth level, which we're not. Uh, to acquire battle trophies, you must first set the internal clock. Okay, uh, you can check battle trophies you have obtained by select battle trophies on the title screen. Battle trophies. Uh, start initialization. Review memory card one. Oh no, hold on. Okay, we'll, we'll go on memory cards. What? Alright, fine. We'll put it on card one. Weird that I have files on both of those. Okay, um, we're just gonna go straight into this. All right, let's play. Computer, start. Player one, Fate Line God. Character, Swordmaster Adonis Klein. User level, Triple A. Yep. Player two. Sophia Esteed. Okay. Character, Flair Witch Cecilia Fairmana. User level, E. Ooh. Battlefield, Remote City of Listia. Monster level, E. Okay. Setup complete. Continue? Yes, please. Okay, we're ready. Preparing to commence. Okay. This simulation system may abort a game if it detects that player safety is at risk. Yep, that's a good practice. I already know that. Practice? Just start. I don't know what I just said. 
Confirmed. Commencing game. Okay. <laughs> Real oh, I'll show you what I've got! Ha! Ha! How do you like ha! that? Wasn't it fun? Um, well, it wasn't too bad, I guess. All right, we're gonna call it quits for that. What do you say we stop now and go get a bite to eat or something? You look pretty bushed. Yeah, I'm beat. <laughs> you hey. need more exercise. Apparently he doesn't learn his lesson. Hmm, guess I'm just a fatty. No one's saying that. Sheesh. Hey, let's go find my mom and dad. Nice, uh, topic right. change there. Oops, I think I cut her off. All right. We'll do this event and then we'll call it quits. What the? Level 2 tremor detected. The system will be temporarily deactivated for your safety. Makes we sense. apologize for any inconvenience. Well, even the robots are polite here. An earthquake? Now that's jumping to, uh... But Haida 4 is a stable world with no tectonic there. activity. There shouldn't be any earthquakes. There are other things that can cause tremors and earthquakes. Especially since, you know, your hair ah! moves. Ah! That's not what... He just did. He did not just say whoa, he said ah. This is an emergency alert. Haida 4 is currently That's under attack not good. by unidentified spacecraft. Okay. All civilians should follow immediate evacuation instructions on the nearest console. Alright. I repeat. Computer, what's going on? Um, Remote Station 7, Haida 3 and Haida 4 so are currently the only under thing by unidentified they're getting ships. extra by asking what's going on is that there's two more areas under attack. Remote Station 7 has scrambled its own ships to mount a counterattack, but they are outnumbered and therefore unable to provide evacuation assistance to Haida 4. Makes sense. An attack by unidentified ships? Yep. Stand by for video display. Wow, the computer was very quick to be like, here, see what's going on out there. I don't care if you're just some, some random guest talking to me. Here you go. See the destruction that is happening outside. Believe it. Uh, well, I mean... As an emergency measure, all transporters have been directly linked to the evacuation terminal. Okay. Please commence evacuation by Fate. following the established route. I repeat, please commence... Don't worry, Sophia. I'll stick with you. Good, because... Thanks. Not a good idea to split up. But who could be attacking us? I've never seen ships like those before. I wonder if mom and dad are alright. Well, probably not the best thing to be thinking right first now. First things first. We gotta get out of here. Yep. 
Let's go. Yeah. All right. So we're gonna call this one quits, and on the next one, we're gonna get out of here. All right, guys. I will see you later.